it's very difficult to describe what happens here. I think um, I think one of the words is value and magic. And these young men, they come here, some of them have never participated in something like this before, and they absolutely transform. That they come here, they come here shy, uh, they're, they're afraid to look, you know, a person in the eye, and they absolutely transform. And this year was four, four days worth of transformation. And they learn integrity, and they learn about honor, and they learn about a lot of the things that are missing from our society today. And the reason I come is because this is really, really important work. Um, that these, these young men are the future. This year, there was a theme, and it was the voyageur theme. Uh, something that happened three, four hundred years ago. And they got to, they got to challenge themselves. They got to work like, like teams. They got to actually experience what a voyageur is all about. They got to learn a piece of history about Canadian culture and Canadian history. And at the end of the four days, uh, these, these men, they, they go from being very, very young men to grown up men. And so what they, what they learn, they can take back into society, they can take back into their lives, they can, they can take back and, and perhaps stop bullying, they can, they can share that with their friends uh, so that they can come back and experience. It's very, very important work and it's been going on for, I believe, over 20 years. A place for young men to learn and trust learn life man. skills and trust your fellow men and learn like the other stuff you don't learn out there and express yourself learning how to work as a team learning how to trust others learning how to let go <laughs> we need those skills in life to succeed the young men will come out with an idea of who they are and who they don't want to be and who they do want to be and, and they'll learn that by bumping up against the adult men who are there and, and the the various roles that are played by the adult men bumping up against them. I really liked being able to push myself to my limit and see how far I could go. And I was surprised with how far, with how far I pushed myself and I was able to go. And also I learned to un understand others more. I looked at those young men and men completely di differently. And I looked at myself do differently after two. It's young men know on some level that they need to do something to move forward. They know and they, they sense it here. There's an opportunity here for them to move forward in their life. A young man comes home, he's more independent. And, and you know, you feel the responsibility of leadership. By the time they walk out of this weekend, their shoulders are back, they're looking up, they're smiling, they're connecting with other men. It's powerful work by powerful men doing great work and making a difference in the world. So. Getting to go through your son's entire teenage years in one weekend with a big group of young men, and uh, I'll be a better father because I'm going to come up against what I came up against with them when I'm dealing with my own children. This is the most rewarding thing I've ever done in my whole life. All men have something in common. If, at the very least, we're all men. And it's not if I come back next year, it's when I come back next year.